This video is sponsored by the JVOS Mindset. It's a new way of thinking of jujitsu. Click the link in the description and get your copy Welcome today. To the Master Plan Lecture Series. My name is Javier Vasquez, and today we are focusing on a JVOS concept. Even though it's not in the original JVOS, it's still within the same genre and realm of JVOS which is something I am calling a positional threshold. So this is building on positional perspective and maximizing a positional perspective. So let's go ahead and get started with positional threshold. So what is positional threshold? Positional threshold is the basic understanding of possibility and limitations of a particular positional perspective. Understanding what is and what is not possible within a positional, a particular position, utilizing a positional perspective. Now, what I mean by this is once you understand the position, once you understand what the starting point is, a positional perspective, there are limitations to each position. There's limitations in flexibility and there's also limitations in possibilities. Once you understand the basic construct of each position, and you understand the borders of the position, that is what I call a positional threshold. There's only so much you can do from each position. There's only so much an opponent can do from a, from a particular position. Once this understanding comes into your consciousness and comes into your mind, that is what a positional threshold is. So I'm gonna to try to give you guys a visual representation of what that is. Now, remember, Positional perspective is the seeding of a particular position and then allowing yourself to understand all of the possibilities within that position. Once you've reached that position, this is what positional threshold is. Through extensive focus over time within a positional perspective, you will reach its positional threshold. Once the threshold has been reached, it will allow for presence and comfort within any position. Once you understand that there are no surprises within a particular position, it allows your mind to be in a more calm and present state of being. With this present state of being comes uh, improved conditioning, improved comfort, and ultimately better decision making. That's why I'm putting this and classifying this under JVOS because ultimately what we're trying to do is help you make better decisions. So of course, we are focusing from the corner outward as a positional perspective, as a starting point, and recognizing the limits of a particular position. So once we've maximized, remember, positional perspective, we started with the yellow arrow, went to the orange, the red, the purple, and the green. We were growing our consciousness. Once we've grown our consciousness from a particular position, from a particular positional perspective, we've reached our threshold. And it doesn't change. It really doesn't change. For many years, I've studied these positions, and, and there's only so much you can do, and this is what represents positional threshold, and this is what I'm talking about. So what I want you to realize is that although positional perspective does grow over time, it comes to a point where you are limited in the amount of what you can do. This is what I consider positional threshold, and understanding that this is a thing, and understanding that um, every position has this, very rarely... Does someone uh, carve out a new path and a new new opportunities? I have done this uh, throughout every position, but of course, every position has its threshold, and this is what I wanted to discuss. The limitations of each position, the, the boundaries of each position, and understanding that working within these boundaries and mastering what is possible within these boundaries is incredibly important. And really, there's so many new things that are coming up in jiu-jitsu, but really what works best and what works is a very small subset of information. And um, this is what I focus on with my jiu-jitsu. I'm not trying to come up with, with a bunch of wackiness that, that over time is inconsistent. My jiu-jitsu, I try to make it very consistent, very effective, and very applicable. Thank you, guys, as always. If you like my content, go ahead, click like and subscribe. And if you really like my content, go ahead and click the notification bell so when I release these new videos, you will be notified. Thanks for watching, and I will see you again real soon.